2013 here with Fox Beta Cayman Studios. We're testing out an air pressurized turbocharger on an 8 horsepower bridge and stretch. Here we go. See if this gives it any more performance. Find out. Okay, I'm testing out an air pressurized turbocharger on the 8 horsepower Brinson Stratton, the generator one. That's in a different video. Uh, it sounded like it was getting more power. I don't know if you heard it go uh, like that. Made like a much more powerful noise than before. And uh, I'm thinking that a, uh, a 10 to 15 psi turbo would make this thing have a lot more power than it does now. Um, I've just got it, the uh, air has screwed into a piece that bolts onto the carburetor, and uh, that's how it's getting its pressure. Uh, let's test it out again. It's going to be loud. I'm warning you. Let's find out. Okay? Whoa, you can hear... Oh. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, uh, here's the engine, and uh, it did sound like it was getting more power from the uh, turbo, the uh, little makeshift turbo. Uh, I'm going to teach you how to make a turbo exhaust pipe. Screws right into the engine, and then... It's just going to have a little hose coming off of it that goes straight onto the carburetor at 15 psi always. And that that thing sounded like it was getting much more power than it had been getting before because you heard when I turned the knob um, you know, to make it get more air, then it revved higher. Uh, yeah, that's really, really interesting. I. I was wondering if it was going to affect its performance at all. Because before, I uh, tested it at uh, 25 PSI, right here, and it was it was dying on me, and the engine was just killing, so I thought it would do that no matter what, and, you know, maybe Briggs and Stratton isn't the right thing to turbo, but apparently it is. I found the right PSI. 15 PSI is just the perfect level if you want to turbocharge your Briggs and Stratton. I, I think this is an 8 horsepower. It might be a 5 horsepower. I don't I don't know. And, uh, this is from my other video. <laughs> Alright, thank you for watching. Please comment, rate, and subscribe, and I might just show you how to make your turbo exhaust. Alright, bye.